Hey guys, back 5 h 20 here, and welcome to Eternal Darkness and Age Requiem. This is going to be another a part of the uh, uh, horror game, October game as well. So, let's get to this. Yeah, whatever. Thank you. Okay, so. This here is another horror game that we're going to play. Flesh. And have oh. fun getting, hopefully getting scared. Bound together with the oddest magical incantation. Magic. This wretched book is where it all began so long ago. I love this guy's voice. Before time. Before humanity. Before. I am Dr. Edward Roybus. Roybus. I am a clinical psychologist. Okay. I am also dead. Well. This is not my story. <gasps> it is the story of the Roybus family. Roybus. It is the story of humanity. Like it or not, believe it or not, as you will. Your perceptions will not change reality, but simply color it. Okay. Humanity has been on the edge of extinction for two millennia. Ooh. Ignorant of so much and dependent on so few. Gotcha. The guardians grow restless. Can I, I can't even skip it. Time once again near. So I actually have to watch this Whether entire cutscene. Whether fate or misfortune, my family has crossed their path. And they didn't take kindly to it. Their attention turns to my granddaughter. For she is the last of my line. And the last hope for humanity. The last hope, hey? Oh, what the fuck is that? Weird. I had a shotgun. Ah! Ah, uh, what do I do? Did I get hit or something? You're starting right into this game without even telling me how to play it. Ah, uh, I got smacked. They smacked me in the butt. Oh. Okay. You have no eyes. Well, that was interesting. Answer the phone, Alex. Jeez. Uh, hello. Mrs. Hi. Alexandra Roybus. Um, yeah, who's this? This is Inspector Legrasse of the Rhode Island Police. I'm sorry to disturb you, but there's been an accident with your grandfather. I'll be on the next flight out. <laughs> didn't even didn't even give her give them any details. She's like, okay, I'll be there. Okay, whatever. Ah, Miss Roybus, I'm pleased to meet you. I trust you had a pleasant trip? Um, Yes, I suppose so, considering. Yes, my condolences. This is most unpleasant. He's chubby. It's a shame we couldn't meet under brighter circumstances. Yes, it is. Can we get this over with, please? Of course. Uh, this way. But I must warn you, it's not a pleasant sight. Okay, I get it. I'm afraid there's not much to see. They just disappear. Not much to see, huh? There's a bloody Mrs. ass. Is that your grandfather, Edward? Yes, it's him. He's wearing our family ring. I don't understand. Why are you showing me this? Can't you check dental records or something? What's wrong with you? I'm... I'm sorry. It's my job, lady. You're the only living relative, and no, we can't check dental records. There's no hair there. Oh, none of this makes sense. There's no sign of intrusion, and there was certainly a lot of force used here. I have never seen anything like this in my 20 years on the force. We have can't get no his head in the game. Except for the body, and what's left doesn't say much. Oh, we don't have a single clue. Well, you better find out who did this. I'm not leaving Rhode Island until you do. 
There must be some clue in this old mansion revealing what happened. I want answers. So do I. She wants answers. I wish I had some. Two weeks later. Shocked by her grandfather's mysterious death and frustrated at the incompetence of the local police, Alex vows to uncover the truth. She decides to search the mansion, the place where... Scroll down. Edward conducted his research. If there was a tie to his past and possibly a tie to his murderer, it would be her. And here I am. Ooh, this game, this game runs at 60 FPS. Heck. Oh, I was holding the trigger. Oops. <laughs> I should definitely record it in a 60 FPS when I get a chance. Portrait of the ancestral Rovius line the foyer line the foyer walls, their faces reveal a dark brooding edge. There's something about each one that gives the viewer an unsettling feeling. Ooh. What's that? Ooh, so we get a spooky come for that booty. What the heck? Huh, 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 huh. Screw this house. Oh well. Uh, okay. Notes. No? Okay. Oh, hey. Ooh, what are you looking at? Family tree. Okay. Anything else here? Whoa. Huh. I do dislike the camera angles a little bit. Nothing? Who is that? Okay. Uh four o'clock, looks like. I wanted to play this game because it's considered like one of the top horror games due to the sanity mirror, uh, sanity thing and everything. But currently, it's just me wandering around the uh, old mansion. Okay, let's go back to the main hall. And the second floor again. Oh, hey, 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 what's that? Clock, 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 clock. Uh, so the clock continues to tick while the are probably set to 3.30, Aha! 3.33, so I guess we figured it out, the combination. That, oh, that's another one. Let's go back to the clock. I know. Uh, let's see, three. One, two, there it is. Ta da! Dang, Grandpa always hiding stuff in um, bookcases and everything. What's this? Okay. I don't want to touch this book yet. I want to touch the sword. Give me the sword. Ancient Roman weapon. Uh, Gladius is on display, but the fireplace went to another token of cyclic junk. Oh! Yay! Now when the zombies inevitably attack, we can like just kill them. The uh, arcane knickknacks, mentals of yesteryear, and other collectibles. The other of ancient texts is, f uh, is faintly noticeable under the peppering of dust that covers every surface, except for when the desk has been under activity. And yet, a lot of dust is on it. Here, Alex Grandfather had worked perhaps even hours before the end. Okay. Can look at the book. Another bound antique book rests upon the cluttered desk. Alex reads the book. She probably shouldn't, but we're going to do it anyway. Cutscene. Ooh. 
Ew. I had no knowledge of what was to come, nor did I care. How the knowledge changed me, it will also change you. As you read this, you will come to learn fear as I have. You too will come to understand, or you will perish. Well, it's not a very nice thing to say. To think that once I could not see beyond the veil of our reality. To see those who dwell behind. Okay. My life now has purpose. For I have learned the frailty of flesh and bone. I was once a fool. Ancient Rome. Where is Quies Candamest? Where is Consovante? They'll need their strength. Oh, make sure they take enough water. And are in high spirits. Today's battle was but one of many. Where did we complete our mission? At once, Centurion Augustus. I would like to compliment you once more on your battle tactics. Our enemies did not have a chance. Okay. They changed it from Do you believe that it really exists in Rome? I do not doubt our emperor's beliefs or Weird. his orders. But if we are to retrieve the artifact, then we must be strong and patient. Oh, strong. Huh. Pios, Pios. This is my ancestor, right? Okay, I'm coming. Why am I coming for? My yellow eyes. Couldn't puzzle it again. Uh-oh. Bada boom. Suddenly, we are here. The dais on the floor is finely crafted and laid with golden gems that Pius can't identify as strong leaner designs situated in the middle and is equally unknown to the Roman soldier. Well. We are not going to observe everything. We're going to like look around. Just here. Uh Okay, so there's a ladder. Where's the ladder? There's the ladder. Uh Next, yeah, he does. Here, I'll climb down this ladder. Ew, dead body. thing aha bring it ah fire ha get wrecked son more. Finish him. No touchy. Yeah, combo him. Finish. Huh. 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 Ta da. What is this thing? A strand on the floor. Pick it up, I guess. Why not? And what's here? Ah, uh, he looks so scared. Finish him. Oh, what's this one do? Yeah, pick it up. Why not? I'll take everything. 
Anything else in this room besides that stuff? Does not look like it. Oh, I like, I like his sneaking too. It's pretty funny. <laughs> okay. Oops. Surprise. I ain't scared of no zombies. So I can like knife you right in the butt. I ain't scared of nothing here. We have three granite blocks. I don't know where we're putting them, but we have them. Uh, nothing over here. Now, what were you looking at? You're looking at something over here. Might be that way. Ah. I love just cutting off their heads because it's just like so random. And I like their reaction because you're like, oh, what the heck? Oh, hush. Don't say my name unless I want you to say my name. Uh. Aha. Stone blocks. I'm missing one. Never mind, I'm not missing one. It's right here. <laughs> nope. No, turn around, Pius. And just keep on cutting off their heads. Can we cut off their arms, too? Stab. Stab, stab, stabby, stab, stab, stab. <laughs> Can't even attack him from here. And he is dead. For real this time. Anything else in this room? No? 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 No! Oh, ooh, wait. Yeah, but obviously that, but anything else besides that? Let's see. What did it do? Cool. What's behind door number one? We'll find out now, won't we? Uh, anything else? Uh, we on. <sighs> Just stab that door. You show the door who's boss. But we will show you what's behind door number one in the next part. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button and subscribe. If not, that's all right. I will see you guys in the next video of what I make. Bye, guys.